Now, from Into Tomorrow, this is an ITTV special report. Our next guest is always surrounded by some of the latest innovative digital products and always a delight to chat with. He's the digital answer man from CEA, the Consumer Electronics Association. Jim Barry, welcome back Into Tomorrow. Well, hello, Dave. Always a pleasure to see you and your crew and... Nice to be here at Innovations. Too, yeah. You know. This is one of my favorites every year because it's pre-CES, mm -hmm. and it is Innovations, which is what our industry is all about. So we get to see the new stuff, the stuff that in some cases is a little farther down the line even than some of the things that will be on the store shelves in the next couple of uh, weeks or yeah. months. Some are a little more into tomorrow. Yeah, well, but these are really cool. There's 29 categories, and this is some something like the 37th year that we've Wow. done what used to be called the Design and Engineering Awards, and now the Innovation, because that's what this industry is all about, these innovations, and in both design and engineering. So we see really cool stuff in in-car technology, in display technology, in mobile technology, all of those different ones. And then some things called, you know, Tech for a Better World, which, you know, at CES, you guys know we have all of these lifestyle places now, including, uh, you know, the Silver Summit uh, yes. for some of us. Uh, some uh, but of us also can relate to that. Things like Mommy Tech and the way we use all of these devices now as they become integral to the way we live. So that's what this Innovations is all about. What we show here are, of these 29 categories, we have a selection on a table over here of some of those categories. You know, some of the winners uh, elect to embargo the fact that they've won and their product itself until CES. So we'll see some of them at CES. Because they make a bigger splash sometimes when they wait for CES. <laughs> Precisely. And, and their exhibit becomes a little right. more exciting for them and others. Right. So at CES, there's this great area every year of innovations honorees, and you'll see every innovation honorees product displayed there, including these ones that were best in each of these categories. And then some of them we show here, and then some folks elect to wait and keep us in suspense yeah. until the show itself. But that's good. It's always good to have a little more excitement. Some yes. here, like, for example, some of the ones that you are showing here. Well, a couple of things. This is from Vuzix, and this is interesting. I brought this along with actually one of the new the new HTC um, Windows phone. This oh, is the yeah. Windows 8X because, you know, a lot of us are storing stuff in the cloud. That's another thing that Innovations is all about is what's coming things that are just getting underway, like the cloud. So you store stuff in the cloud, and now you pick up your smartphone and you check out what you have there. Well, with this View 6 viewer, you just wear this over your ear and you have a little heads-up display out in front of you so you can view this kind of like those Google glasses, too, yeah. and see what's out there and still see what's going on around you. So this is one of those... Um, items that really reflects this movement to the cloud, mobile devices, Bluetooth, wireless, all of those different uh, developments that are at the forefront of what consumer electronics are so all about. So on this little screen, yeah. we're seeing it's, what's coming from our You will see what's coming phone. from your smartphone. So you could watch a video, yeah. or you could just check your emails. Not you while driving. All those things. I'm oh, going to say that. Not while driving, absolutely never. Absolutely not. No. But while walking... Because your left eye is open and can watch for poles, but your right eye can see <laughs> this heads-up display. Right, right. So at any rate, but when you think about it, though, the the uh, elements or the, the technologies that are really uh, at the forefront of new stuff in consumer electronics, whether it's cloud computing, mobile computing, uh, wearing all this stuff, wireless connections, all of these reflected in something like that. Yeah. We've got this one other cool product. This is the spare one. You may have seen this before. I have. It's and, very and cool. And what's been going on in the last uh, several weeks here in the metropolitan area, but also just anywhere uh, in the world for that matter. The spare one is great. It's a phone. Runs on one double A battery, and you can just put that away with your emergency kit um, for up to 15 years, and then it will work for 10 hours on that one double A battery when you need it. When that emergency comes and your cell phone is dead. 
pull that SIM card out of your phone, pop it in there, and you're in business for up to 10 hours. Great in an emergency. Yeah. Do 911. Uh, call your uh, family. All of those things to let them know you're and all right. can so you change the, the spare AA one. battery so you keep a spare Oh, yeah, then you could do that. Yeah. Sure, sure. But the one battery that you put in there, you say, is good for 15 years. So that's a good long time. Yeah, you because forget, most you of us, it. Yeah, well, most <laughs> of us have, you know, um, I know in our house we were looking for the flashlights again a few weeks ago. We yeah. said, oh, no, those were at the beach house. Oh, no, no, we got to get those. But that's the kind of thing that you want to make sure that you have on hand. So yeah. this is, again, tech for a better world, which is a new category in the last couple of years um, that this is really representative of. Love it. Well, you keep bringing us the cool stuff. And, in fact, this week's video, we're going to be highlighting a lot of these Innovations cool. Award winners. So we want to invite our audience to visit intotomorrow.com for more. And, of course, don't miss the highlight video and the video of all of the radio interviews this week, including Jim's, are there for you. Again, at intotomorrow.com. CESweb.org for more information about the upcoming huge 2013 International CES. Jim, thanks for spending a few minutes with us here. Thank you. And CES Web slash innovations, you can see all of these as well. And then we'll be able to actually we'll get the list and then we'll be able to see them on intotomorrow.com. Very good. Thanks. Love it. We're back with more from New York. Don't go away. 